The demo is to demonstrate. Demo is. Who let the dogs out? Woof, 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 woof. So, hi, dear ones. Um, I want to start this video by saying one thing first. I grew up playing video games. From the tender age of four. By the way, my first game was uh, Nintendo's Banana Prince, for everyone who wants to know, <laughs> until my early 20s. Uh, for a young boy in Lithuania, these were a form of magical escapism. But at the some point there was a change in my interests, since I realized that I'd rather take a more active approach and create my own stuff. I started to recreate scenes from my favorite video games, making tribute videos and short experimental films that were heavily inspired by the games of my childhood. Games like Deus Ex, System Shock, Vampire Masquerade Bloodlines, Gothic series, Manhunt, oh, that one is very controversial, <laughs> and Unreal series, just to name a few from a lot of games I played in my life, so much. But my last game was Max Payne 3, and kind of marks the end of my gaming era. So what happened next was that a few days ago I discovered a small shop where you can find all sorts of games, consoles, electric equipment, like everything you want and you need if you're into classic games. It's beats and bytes in these buttons. And today I finally managed to stop and look what I found in the corner of the shop. No, poo. It's too bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, today, uh, finally, I managed to stop by and look what I found in the corner of the shop. Look at this bad boy! Now that's a beautiful box. Literally, a very beautiful box. And it's like a special edition collector's Max Payne free box. You see? It's a big boy. <laughs> I could not believe my eyes, <laughs> since I was searching for it for many, many years. Like, for many years, to, you know, some kind of flea market or something like that. I could always uh, download it from internet, from Amazon or something like that, but I thought that it's cooler to find it. It's like, a, you know, a finding in your way. It's, I'm very happy. Balls to the wall action game. It's wicked. <laughs> I don't know if you know the game, so I will not further discuss its plot since I don't want to spoil it for you. For me and uh, all the media, video games, comics, uh, movies and all, you know, etc. Um, the most important thing is first time. When you experience the thing for the first time, when someone is um, spoiling it for you, you already know and you know what is coming. So the first time is the most, the beautiful time. When you don't know, you don't, you just don't know, <laughs> you know? And I just... This is my gift for you, dear viewer. First time of this game. This was not just the last game I played, but in my opinion, also one of the last well-crafted classic action games created. So, which was probably one of the reasons why shortly after I just stopped gaming. <laughs> I completely stopped gaming. This was like a, it was stop, full stop, completely full stop. So with that said, Let's unbox this motherfucker, eh? Look at this! Look at this! Oh my god, it looks nice. I'm looking nice. <laughs> I'm looking nice. 